If you ever have flickering problem on your MacBook Pro, this video is for you. So when it's cold, it's flickering, but when it's warm, it doesn't. So I use two programs to solve that problem. So as you can see, I'm using two different software, TG Pro and SMC Fan Control. So right now, I click on TG Pro, I already installed it. So when you, click, when you click on TG4, TG4 is not free, but SMC, it's free. So on TG4, as you can see right now, it show me on the top of my windows, all the, all those sensor it got. So he got the sensor for the core one, core two, the, the graphic, the graphic sensor all of those even the form rest sensor on your macbook pro so right now i am showing you how you can do the configuration of your fan so my problem on the laptop is the laptop always flickering when the temperature is really cold so below 38 it start flickering but when it's really warm it does not give that problem at all so what i am doing i just set up the the temperature as you can see i go i click 100 percent always but any sensor above 15 percent i need to slow down the pc i need to slow down the pc to 50 percent so that's or I configure my TG4. Also, you got the temperature Celsius or Fahrenheit. So you can configure it uh, different, depend of which configuration you got on your temperature. So right now I am gonna show you how to use SMC fan control. SMC fan control is really free, but there's an option for donation for the developer. So it's really free the temperature is also on the first screen so now you get the configuration act that just help the screen so when you go on configuration you can set up for battery when your computer is on battery you can control the fan for that when it's on AC power you can control it for that also even when you're charging your laptop you can still run the fan after resetting the laptop, the fan won really good. So I, after like two minutes, I don't really have that problem anymore. So that's really a help. See if you got the same problem, definitely guys, I recommend you do that. Leave on the comment on the video, what you think about it, what problem you're facing of, and how I can continue to help you. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to watch the next video on the playlist. Thank you, have a good one.